Flying sorcery and Alamance is so much fun with mods. I swear, I need 10 to 12 years of therapy. Is that why my girlfriend left me? Hey, what's going on, guys? It's the Blue Pictures here, and welcome back to another episode of Tom Craft Tutorial. Tom Craft Tutorials, sorry. Uh, and for this episode, it's going to be a little bit different. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to install mods on Blade and Sorcery Nomad, and also to clarify some errors if you come across into modding this to modding this game. So, uh, so let me go ahead and start with a clarification with uh, on if you end up getting an error saying that cannot load level uh, file from for master or whatever. When you try to load the game with a with a mod install, like it was supposed to be like a BAT file that that you originally mod that uh, before the 1.10.2 or not 1.10.2, but the before the uh, title update 10.2 file. Uh, well, the thing is, is that they changed the uh, BAT file and they made they changed that to where if you if you if you alter that file in any way. It will cause a level loading error, so which means that uh, you will have to uninstall and reinstall the game to uh, to be able to access the game again for that. But for this new update, not only that it removes that option there, but it also makes things much easier to install the mod. So anyway, without further ado, if you got a game that's like that's like giving you the level loading error. Uh, just uninstall, reinstall the game, and then uh, and then you should be good to go. And once you have a fully fresh vanilla Blade and Sorcery Nomad game that's uh, with no errors or anything for the Quest 2, now you can listen to this tutorial. So anyway, let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing that you're going to go to, I'll put a link in the description for the website. You have to go to nexusmods.com dash Blade and Sorcery Nomad dash mods dash. All right, I'll put a link in the description for this. And this is where you're going to get all your mods at, okay? There are latest ones right here, like the Star Wars lightsabers, tactical weapons, telekinesis, decent. Dark saber, a dark saber spawning spell, though you'll have to have this mod for that, but it's still really cool. Uh, dismemberment, fragmenting, katana, infinity blade, yada, 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 yada. I mean, you got a pretty good list of stuff right here. So anyway, I'll put a link in the description for both of this and, uh, and... Uh, for this link and it'll be freaking awesome so anyway let's go ahead and get started so what you'll have to do is select the mod that you want to download okay this can range from maps weapons uh spells uh stat like uh, not stat upgrades but um uh, but base but also um but also mechanic update the uh, updatings and whatever uh what do i want to install so, uh, basically, uh, let's try the Sword of a Fallen Templar. I haven't even installed this one yet. So, what you want to do is, and, and besides, keep in mind, you also have to make an account here. So, you'll have to make an account for this to work. I, I'm not going to go in the process of making an account, but I'm sure you can figure that out on your own. But you'll have to make an account in order to download any of these mods. So, what you do is that you get the mod that you want. It'll give you a bit of info right here, and some of the mods uh, will show you a tutorial how to make it, but how how to how to install them. But th this is what you got this tutorial for. So, uh, you go take the mod and you click download manual, and uh, no, for not members or cat. Okay, Ma manual. Hold on a second. Okay, okay, yeah, I never mind. I'm sorry. Uh, sometimes it'll give you an option like this. So. Uh, Okay, so this one will say this will give for this mod particularly it will give you two different files uh, that you can select uh, select off of. Usually the mods so they'll send you straight to the download spot, but we'll get to that in just a second. So for this one, do I want uh, do I want the no trail or the tr or the trail? You know what? Uh, let's just go ahead and go with the one with the trail. So go click manual download, and you'll be prompt up to this screen. Okay, so. Okay, it says for a free account, you can get for like 2 megabits a second. Or you can get the premium and it'll give you the max download. Besides, I mean, the files are usually small anyway, so just go ahead and use the slow download. There's no sense into, uh, there's no sense in making a premium membership for this. And it'll get, it'll prompt you a download right here. And, uh, and there you go. You'll have your, you'll have your file into your downloads. Alright, so what I do is go ahead and extract it to your not extract it, but put it on your desktop. 
and that's and that's what we got right here all right so i'll go ahead and close this so i don't need this anymore so now we need to go inside to your oculus quest headset okay so uh but when you plug in your oculus quest headset you'll be prompted you'll have to allow this allow the um file access inside your headset itself so you'll have to go into your headset and uh you'll have to allow allow it to go into your file so click allow into your headset and then you'll be given access to the quest 2 folder right here it may look a little different because of this the mine's a phone but however uh however it you'll it'll say quest 2 so you go into here internal shared storage device and where you need to go to from here is go to android data blade and sorcery files and then uh, and thanks to the new update you got a mods folder I already got a few mods installed here okay uh butterstat all all that kind of good stuff all right now remember keep in mind as of the new update as of the new update the blade and sorcery folder that has the uh that has the bat folder whatever it's called from the last update where we used to mod it at uh you can't do that anymore so you'll have to go through data blade and sorcery files and you got a new mods folder so for now on that's where your mods are going to be at so and besides to keep in mind uh the bat used to have butter stabs for altercation but however you can throw that to the uh, you can throw that in there now so what you want to do is if you want to you can extract it if you want to but for me i open the file and then the folder inside of here all you gotta do is drag it onto your desktop or you can extract it if you want to it don't matter and then you can drag it into this the folder right here and there you go you have it installed and if you have the game running in your headset already just uh close the application on your headset and then uh, reload the game and it will be in your game it may take a little longer just a dab longer for the game to load but however it will load with all these mods okay so anyway um that's all i got to say for this episode uh but i, I will go ahead and clarify what i said in the beginning of the video uh if you got an error saying that you it cannot load level for master or cannot load level for, cannot load level um uh, that or whatever if you can't if you can't load the level for master error shows up onto your headset uninstall the game and reinstall it and then and throw all your mods into that folder all right so anyway that's all i gotta say i hope you guys enjoyed this one if you did be sure to show some love hit that like button down below also if you're at all new to my channel be sure to hit the subscribe button turn on notifications and become a part of the notification squad i hope you guys enjoyed this one and with that being said i'll see you dudes next time Peace out, Majorolics.